EastEnders spoilers, heist culprit finally revealed? Kino Star drops biggest hint yet. EastEnders viewers have been left guessing as to who has the stolen New Year's Day heist money, but one star of the show may have just revealed who the real culprit is. Fans were previously convinced that Ben Mitchell, played by Harry Reid, had double-crossed his further and stolen the loot from the robbery. But when he fled Walford to start a new life on the continent, Ben's case was full of newspapers and he only had a small envelope of money. Now, Danny Walters, who stars as Keno Taylor in the BBC soap, has promised the reveal will take place very soon and viewers will be stunned when they find out who has the cash. Speaking exclusively to Express.co.uk, the actor teased, Everyone is questioning each other over who could potentially have the money that was stolen from Aiden, and so it's basically exploring and discovering who has the money, which you will find out very soon. It could be anyone. It could be any of the guys or it could be anyone of the square. It's definitely one to look out for and watch. It will explode. The actor went on to add that his character will get his hands dirty just to get some money. Could Kinu have secretly stolen the money to help the Taylor family with their financial woes? It certainly seems likely as Danny noted there is so much drama still to come from the family. They are such a unique family on the square, the 24-year-old said. There's no other family like the Taylor family. There's so much to be told about the Taylors that you haven't even touched the surface. 2018 is going to be a fantastic year for them and you're going to find out a lot more about who they are. Danny has been nominated for Best Newcomer at this year's National Television Awards and said he was humbled to be considered. I've said to people before that when I joined this show, when I joined EastEnders, when I joined this industry and wanted to become an actor, that I didn't become an actor to win the awards, he commented. I love what I do on a daily basis, I love telling stories, working with the people I'm working with, so the fact that I've been nominated for an award is a real honor. It's nice to know that what I'm doing is getting that recognition. It's just a fantastic feeling, stick feeling.